Alright, this is Cody Jarvis for iOS. Because for some reason, they won't put it on Cydia. I think because they're trying to get it in the App Store. Then that's why they're not releasing it for Cydia. A couple things you're going to need. App Sync. Make sure you have the App Sync compatible with your iOS. I'm running iOS 9.3, so I'm using Unified. Um tool I'm going to be using you're going to want open SSH if you don't have that this is for a jailbreak only so you should have open SSH yeah link your device you hit that little tab there in the beginning put your email in fake email whatever And you're going to get this. I'm going to install it. Then you're going to have to trust it. Kind of like the jailbreak, the new jailbreak there. You gotta, it's pretty much what you're doing. Same thing. And you see that app there. We'll go and make sure this is verified. AppDB device link. Let's check that out. Verified. Okay, so we're ready to go. Now we want to go back to that address. Actually, I think you go inside the app also. But let's just go to the address. Right, once we're in here, we want to go to, what was it? Yeah, Cydia Apps. Which is odd because I can't find it in Cydia. But it's in here. There is an old one that they have up. You know, the dev team that makes Cody. They have the old version up. Cody 15. This is Cody 16.1 Jarvis. Like the newest, stablest one they have out. But they got Krypton now, I think it's called. They're doing it's uh, Cody 17. But I don't think they have any stable versions out yet. This is 16.1. Yeah, okay, everything. It's gonna ask to install. Let's install it. Ah, right, you know you're gonna have to give it a minute. It's installing as we speak. See, installing. Now let's give it a couple minutes. Not even, that is, a minute. Uh, open it up, you'll see Jarvis version 16.1 popped up there. That's it, you have Cody. You have Cody Jarvis now on your iDevice. Right now what you're going to do, you can do, is install my uh, backup, which has everything you'll need on Cody. Um, yeah, my backup though, it does have some uh, adult content, so beware. I'm going to use my backup, make sure you're 18 or older. So if you already installed Cody, you're done. You don't have to do any of this. I'm going to uh, show my buddies how to install my backup. I'm going to pick a remote path. If you notice the address up top there, you see. We're going to have to find that. Yeah, that's the file. We have to find that file. We're going to drop my backup in. This is where you need open SSH. Yeah, that's the full address. That's where you're going to find it in your phone. That folder you're going to find. So... We have to go to that address there. We're going to go to mobile, container, data, application, which it doesn't tell you, but that's the one. And now we'll find the OCE8. There we go. We found it. See? 81412. And then we're going to go into documents. 
I gotta minimize this phone so I can find my bag up. This will be my bag up. If you download it, you'll have to extract it. It'll look like this. Drop it in here. Right in the documents there. This is going to take a few minutes. There's a lot of stuff in there. There's a lot of stuff I don't even use. I'm pretty sure you can uninstall a lot of it. But it's got everything you'll ever need. It's like a super Netflix... I got live live channels. It's installed now. That's all you should see inside that folder. I'll go inside there. Add-ons, user data, yada yada. That's it. Should be nothing else inside there. So now we're gonna go back to the phone. Now we have to go into backup, right there. That's going to be our path now. Hit OK, so it saves. Now tap backup again. Hit restore. Tap the restore, or the backup. Yep. It's going to take a couple minutes again. We'll fast forward through take up too much time all right once this is done now close out of the app completely close it up go into your app switcher shut it down completely now open the app back up let everything update it ain't gonna take more than 10 seconds it's going to be the first time you're loading up my backup, so it's going to need a little updating. Usually after the TV guides, you're good to go. Sometimes it'll trick you to pause for a minute, you think it's done, and then boom, yeah, see, pops up. Let's give it a second. It's not going to do this every time. This the first time the TV guide should be the last one give it a second just in case alright we're good let's go to video add-ons these are all the video add-ons there let's go to C-Cloud, C-Cloud is like live channels right, top 10 you know, AMC, Comedy Central, let's check it out. I'm pretty sure the video is going to be a little choppy because my computer is actually doing a lot of stuff right now, believe it or not. Yeah, as you can see, it's a little choppy. Plays perfectly fine, though. It's just this video here, all the stuff my computer is going through at the moment. I'll go back, I'll show you my favorite one. They got a channel in here, or channels, I should say. Uh, oh, hit the wrong thing. Let me get out of here. But anyways, it's called 24-7. Pretty much what that is is they have tons of TV shows. They just play that TV show 24-7. They also have movie channels, like an action movie channel. Right there at the top, you see action movie. It just plays action movies. It's always good movies too. It's awesome. Uh, right here, TV show South Park. It's, this is gonna be South Park all day, every day. And that's it. You're hooked up, man. You'll need nothing else for TV. All you'll ever need, right here.